Hello. So <laughs> Hello beautiful twin and welcome to this webinar where we will teach you exactly how to end the twin flame separation stage. So most of you are likely in the separation stage and you're wondering, you know, is it possible to reunite properly, harmoniously, how long will it take? And many of you are probably thinking, is it worth it? Uh, sh it with all this hassle back and forth and you might have had the, this running stage coming se several times and you wonder, um, should I just settle for a karmic or, or a soulmate? Is it worth that twin flame journey? So yes, it is possible. If we can do it, you can do it too. There's a series of steps you can take, things you can do. And yeah, it's definitely possible. It's definitely worth it. And in this video, we'll explain how you can do it. This webinar is gonna be very action packed. So make sure to close any tabs, uh, get your phone away, put it on flight mode, bring out paper and pen so that you can take notes and be fully present and absorb this information. Okay, you might be wondering why you should listen to us. So we've been in union for three years and we had a relatively short separation stage, you know, just a few months. Um, it was difficult, but it wasn't, you know, crazy. There wasn't this crazy, like, decades of waiting, seeing the other, per pe other person with other people, married, married? Being married, you know, having kids with other people. There was none of that. Since we've been reunited, if whenever, wherever we've had disagreements, they've really been kind of catalysts that lead to growth or major breakthroughs where we've become actually closer afterwards and we really analyzed this and dissected like what happened why did it happen like with such a speed run right yeah. uh, uh, why why this for us and then we came to some conclusions of why uh, we were able to fast track our union so that's what we're going to share with you today so yeah, we're Twin Flame Guides, so we teach people like you how to reach Union. So do make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. Um, we also have a podcast uh, and a blog where you can read Twin Flame articles as well. So yeah, we've been helping Twin Flames for several years now, and we really look forward to teaching you know, how to shortcut the separation stage and finally unite with your divine counterparts. So in almost all cases, you know, with the vast majority of people, the stress, uncertainty, doubt, and pain associated with specifically the separation stage, but really the whole twin flame journey, they don't need to happen that way. You know, there's obviously gonna be difficulty, there's obviously gonna be challenges and growth that needs to happen, but it doesn't need to be this crazy traumatic event that a lot of people experience as twin flames. There is a better way, and it is in most cases a choice, depending on your subconscious beliefs, and the way that you interact with yourself and with your twin flame, and a few other things which we'll get onto in this video. In this webinar, you're going to learn that we humans, we are not very different from computers actually, in that we have a kind of software, uh, hardware, and operating system. So we're going to dissect this, what we mean with this. We will go through your hardware, your software, your operating system, how this relates to the twin flame journey, and how you can, by programming your software and your hardware, uh, you can uh, shorten the separation stage. Okay, so let's just get straight into it. So the operating system is something which can have multiple names, uh, the divine matrix, the hologram, but really just refers to everything around us. Everything that we experience as real is kind of the operating system or the stru like the structure, the matrix. And then within that operating system, uh, you know, you have all the different humans or different people and they all are kind of like computers running that operating system. And then within those computers, so within each person, you have different programs or software, which in this case we mean uh, as to be like beliefs, um, me beliefs, memories, personality, like the way you filter reality and create it. And this is um, built up through previous lives. It can be both on Earth and on other planets. Um, traumas you've had, uh, especially in childhood. So almost exactly like software, you will have these kind of default states within your programming. Within your beliefs, you'll have these default reactions and patterns. Unless you change them, they're just going to keep repeating again and again. Um, unless you actually step in and become aware of it, in, in the case of like beliefs, let's say, and change it, you're just going to have the same experience again and again, the same repetitive, you know, um, you might have trouble in relationships, you might have trouble financially, the same patterns will keep repeating if you don't become aware of it and change those patterns or change the software. Yes, exactly. And you might think, okay, so what if I change my programs? How does that relate to my twin flame, right? What if my twin flame is not doing the work? How is this gonna speed up a union? And um, 
the interesting thing is, since you were once the same soul and then you split, uh, you're now, of course, different souls, but you are entangled on a quantum level. So when you do your inner work, when you when you um, change and release limiting beliefs, uh, when you raise your vibrations, all this is going to affect your twin flame as well. And it's going to help you both unite faster. So because most of these programs, these pieces of software are subconscious, the operating system doesn't really push you in a specific direction. It just kind of plays out the software that you run operating system is like the canvas and then you decide through the programs what you paint on that canvas so unless you change these programs and these beliefs and these like this default state it will seem like it's kind of just happening to you and that you have no control over it no influence you know you can't guide it and you can't create what you want and that's why you have um, a lot of people especially now with this kind of victim mindset where they they feel like the world is just happening to them mm. and around them instead of the opposite point of view, which is that they are actually creating from within, they're creating all of those experiences. It's debatable as to whether it's unbiased or not, you know, as to whether it's like completely neutral or there's actually a divine design behind it. That's really an, a topic for another video. I don't think it matters too much which mm. one it is. All that matters is it does respond to the software and it's a very much an input output sort of thing. You know, if you change the programs and beliefs, you get a different result from the operating system. All right, so now we're gonna move into the software part of the webinar. Yeah, so the software is really, yeah, emotions, beliefs, wounds, traumas, any kind of um, patterns, negative holding patterns based on memories or traumas. It can really be anything that affects your subconscious default states. It's usually beliefs that come from somewhere else. Usually it's like a doctrine, whether it's a religious doctrine or whether it's an educational thing or you know, whether it's something that society tells you, expectations, these are all programs. These are kind of ideas and stories that can be true if you want them to be, but they don't have to be true. Okay, so in terms of like how, to, how do you actually end the separation stage and create what you want to experience? It seems to be based on emotion. Emotion seems to be the language of the matrix, the language of, of this mm. operating system, almost like the, the code, if you wanna continue using computer analogy. It's like the code that the operating system runs on. So when you have a certain emotion, it has a certain frequency. And this is probably not news to you, right? So you have a certain frequency, that frequency then goes out to everything else and attracts things to you at that same frequency. So let's say if you have a frequency, uh, you have the emotion of um, anger, that frequency will then put out um, almost like a message to everything, which will then attract things to you that will make you either continue being angry or other people that are angry will then come towards you. Negative situations, maybe you'll get, you know, you'll get into an accident, you'll, some bad things will, will gravitate towards you. In exactly the same way, if you have the emotion of gratitude, then you will experience more of the things you're grateful for now. And yes. this has been proved, this is, this is mentioned, you know, countless times. If you look at interviews with top CEOs, entrepreneurs, uh, personal growth experts, gurus, one of the most common things they say is that gratitude is really powerful because when you're grateful for what you already have, the universe or, you know, the operating system sends you more of that same thing. You get more of what you focus on. So to take that one step further, if you have the emotion or the energy or the mindset of lack of not having something, if you're constantly focusing on, oh, I need to you know, search for my twin flame, for example, the operating system or the universe basically takes that and says, okay, so I'll give you more of that then. You know, mm -hmm. I'll continue this lack, I'll keep you away from your twin flame. So in many ways, most people are actually holding themselves back from reunion. Or, even, or anything really, anything they want to experience. They're holding themselves back by reminding themselves they don't have it. So, okay, so you might be thinking, well, what do I do then? You basically need to transition from feeling and, and believing that your happiness is somewhere out there waiting to reunite with you and instead feel that already now. So try and move towards feeling complete and reunited now and then the universe will bring you that feeling, you know, bring, or bring you more of that feeling. And this might sound easier said than done, but if you remember that you are actually already in union with your twin flame on higher levels. Mm. So it's just 
taking a bit of time now, like most of you are going to unite with your twin flame in this lifetime, since we are approaching the golden age and you will be the new leaders of society together with other light workers and star seeds. Uh, if you remember that on, on a 5D level, you are you are married to your twin flame. So that is, is actually true. It's not like you have to, um, uh, you have to fake it till you make it. You have already made it, right? It's just here on the 3D level where it's, um, it's a lot of duality. And of course, uh, the negative power wants to keep your twin flame away from you here. Uh, so remember that on higher levels, you are already together with your twin flame and that will help with that feeling of uh, completeness and union. So it's really important to avoid the negative emotions because when you experience mm -hmm. an emotion usually if you keep experiencing it you'll get more of that thing you'll get more of that emotion so if you have if you're constantly surrounding yourself with negative things whether it's media people situations you know or you're watching certain movies listening to certain music that creates negative emotions you're going to get more of that yeah. and this is especially true with things like uh, the news or media in our opinion you should basically not watch mainstream media at all because it's almost entirely negative fear based and it creates negative emotions in you those negative emotions then attract more of that stuff exactly so what we've done practically to avoid negativity in our lives is we have a browser extension called turkey blocker cold turkey blocker a cold turkey blocker exactly and uh there you can you can choose a setting which is uh, uh, removing the news sites. So if, when you have that block active, every time you go to a news website, that will be blocked. And when you have your TV, uh, we recommend just like having a Netflix or Amazon Prime or whatever where you you watch your uh, your films and not put on these uh, BBC and all yeah. these these channels that are constantly streaming these very negative news. Because, uh, yeah, I think some people, they wake up and they, they watch the news in the morning and stuff like that, but you don't have to have a morning routine like that. You can have one that is more focused on what you can control, like having a nourishing morning routine mm -hmm. with meditation, etc., that sets you up positively for the day. What are you doing to create a more positive environment? Let us know in the comments. You'll be surprised as well how quickly the universe echoes back to you what you, what you focus on. Like if you just go one day without checking the news, without checking social media and instead immersing yourself in positive things, you know, inspiring interviews, videos, you know, maybe you go out for a walk in nature. The, the universe echoes that back to you so quickly that you almost forget about all of these, you know, all of this fear that the media is trying to push on you. Yes. And when it comes to watching films, um, we have started focusing more on comedies, more light-hearted stuff, spiritual documentaries, mm -hmm. instead of these thrillers, scary movies, depressing drama series uh, with sometimes hidden bad agendas, you know? So uh, really be careful what movies and series you choose to watch as well uh, yeah. to increase the positivity in your day-to-day -day life. So just to reiterate, you need to try and focus on feeling like you're already reunited with your twin flame and the universe will eventually or even quickly echo that back to you. Yeah, so one powerful way you can do that is to use affirmations. So saying out loud sentences that you want to be true, like I am with my twin flame, I, I am in union with my twin flame, that kind of thing. And that will then be echoed back to you. And especially the more, the more times you say it and the more strongly you believe it, it will become part of you and then you'll experience it. Write in the comments now, I am eternally one with my true twin flame. I am internally one with my true twin flame. Yeah, in our um, uh, flagship um, program, Twin Flame Reunion Fast Track, we actually have um, an affirmation document with the affirmations that we recommend you use as a twin flame to mm. speed up um, union. So um, check the link in the description if you want to uh, check that course out. Another powerful tip is to meditate. You know, this has benefits beyond just Twin Flame Reunion, but specifically it helps to d detach your awareness, your consciousness, from all of these random programs, beliefs and ideas, the ego, distractions, and all of these, these kind of thoughts. And it helps you to just go within and remind yourself that you're the awareness of the thoughts and not the actual thoughts. The thoughts themselves, you can change, but the awareness is kind of eternal, you know, the, the consciousness behind the thoughts. So meditation is really powerful for that, especially if you do it first thing in the morning. 
So yeah, Julia meditates for an hour a day. I usually meditate for between five and 10 minutes a day, <laughs> which is a lot less. So, but even just a few minutes, even one minute, to be honest, or one or two minutes in the morning will make a huge difference to you. Yeah, just try to do it consistently. Um, many people prefer to do it in the morning as part of their morning routine mm. before they get distracted by other stuff uh, in their life. Um, if you want to explore this further and how to, how to conquer your mind, become more soul-based, then I highly recommend the book, The Untethered Soul, where uh, the author talks about that we have an inner roommate. So our, our, our ego is always like talking to us, saying negative thoughts, uh, belittling us. And like, if you had a roommate like that, you would probably leave <laughs> and find a different roommate, right? But we have this person in our head constantly talking negatively to ourselves. And we need to distance ourselves and realize this roommate, this really negative, uh, aggressive roommate is not us. And once you've found that distance, then it will be so much easier to unite with the twin flame because you don't have that negative self-talk. Um, and the first step is awareness to just, hey, when you have these negative thoughts, th this is not me, this is just my inner roommate. So with the emotions, right? So I said about how our emotions are kind of the language of the matrix. They influence what we receive back and what we experience. You might be thinking, okay, well, that sounds a bit crazy. You don't really know how that's true. So there's actually been an experiment done, which I find really interesting where they took DNA from this guy and they put the DNA in a room 200 miles away from the guy and they measured it electronically, electrically, right? So they stimulated the guy's emotions and instantaneously, as soon as they stimulate the guy's emotions, there's an electrical reaction in the DNA 200 miles away. Even though they're, they're not connected mm -hmm. in any way, there's no time delay. Like yeah. the emotions get stimulated, immediately the DNA is, it changes. You know, it produces a different electrical signature. So what this shows is that there's no separation in in this operating system. Everything is connected. Mm. And when you affect one thing, and the interesting thing is specifically is it was emotions that did this. It wasn't anything else. It, it was emotions. So when he had a positive emotion, the DNA starts lighting up in all these beautiful patterns. That's really fascinating to me because mm. that shows that there is this connection and that our emotions can physically change things 200 miles away it could even be on another planet you like our emotions can change things anywhere instantaneously so it's not just this random thing it's this real measurable effect that happens so not only are we entangled with essentially everything but we're more strongly entangled with our twin flame so when you do work on yourself let's say it affects your other twi your your twin flame and vice versa you know um when for example julia's on her in her time of the month it physically affects me as well. And sometimes like randomly, you know. Um, yeah, it's, it's, so, it's so funny. Uh, when Steph is like, oh, I feel so irritated today. I don't know. Yeah. And then I tell him, well, we're on our period. <laughs> so yeah, so it, it defi there is def definitely this connection and this effect that happens. And um, this study really shows that your emotions do have an in impact, even if you don't think they do, or if you think it's just, you know, just little you meditating in your room you are essentially influencing everything in this hologram, in this reality that we're in. You're influencing everything, even in a small way, um, but especially your, your twin flame as well. So how can you actually use this practically to help end separation? So we know emotions are the key. What you, ex what you have as an experience, the universe will give you more of. Well, the answer is pretty simple. You need to just find and do things that give you positive emotions um, start doing things like gratitude journaling where you write mm. down every morning what you're grateful for start visualizing and imagining that you're already with your twin flame and in the fast track program we have a, a guided meditation that julie recorded with binaural beats it gives you this um, thing you can listen to every morning which will help you visualize already being with your twin flame and even just simple things like you know just going and, and uh, walking barefoot on the grass or just doing thing dancing to your favorite music or just doing uh, the things that give you positive emotion make you feel good and at the same time doing less ideally none of the things that make you feel negative emotions don't do the things that make you feel angry drained depressed mm. uh, confused avoid those things and it, there might be people as well it might be like you spend time with a certain person and you always feel drained you feel like annoyed frustrated stop seeing them, stop spending time with that person. Mm. And then you won't experience more of those negative emotions. You're just kind of leaving it alone. 
And then again, the first step here is awareness. Mm. So next time you feel a very strong negative emotion, journal it. Put it in your journal and say, this person made me feel drained, um, irritated, for example, or uh, going to this website, this blog, or this, this Netflix show. Mm. Um, so the next time it happens, uh, catch yourself and be like, hey, or this happened again. Why, am I, why do I keep doing this? This will not help me on my twin flame journey. And, try, and really try, like Steph said, to be grateful as much as you can throughout the day mm. and think about how grateful you are to be in, in, in your union, um, that your twin flame is coming soon into your life, because uh, gratitude is such a high vibration. Um, one of the most powerful ways to change your software, so to say, is by doing your inner work, your shadow work, really going into the wounds you have uh, which can be created really early on in your life, uh, in childhood. Maybe you had parents who... A favorite sibling or something. Yeah, a favorite sibling, for example, and it wasn't you. Um, or so that have made you competitive now. Or maybe you went into, an, you went into a car accident, um, which has created fears. So really going back to what happened in childhood. Is there any traumas I could have? And it can be just one sentence, like something mm. that your, your parents said to you that is affecting you to this day. And if you want to learn more about how, what specific exercises you can do um, to um, heal your inner child, then definitely check out our Twin Flame Reunion Fast Track uh, link in the description. So we're about to get onto the hardware section. I would say this is one of the most important sections about how th practical things you can do. Before we do that, we need to mention the course we've been talking about, the Reunion Fast Track, and what's included. I think this is going to really help you to have an actionable step-by-step -step plan, what you should do to reunite, basically, effortlessly and fast, much faster than you would usually. This is the most effective and detailed course on attracting and reuniting with your twin flame ever. A huge ebook PDF is included, a guided meditation audio to visualize your twin, several videos, a printable morning routine, affirmation sheet and the raise your frequency ebook a foolproof seven step action plan to attract your twin flame and reunite with them faster than you thought was possible we're a twin flame couple who are actually in happy union this means we practice what we preach and it works most other twin flame girls aren't even with their twin and preach negative fear-based narratives about the journey which can stop you from reuniting with your twin flame so here are some of what you're going to learn. How to use our unique guided meditation track every morning to visualize and magnetize your twin flame into your life. Exactly how the twin flame connection works and what the true purpose of this connection actually is. Our entire story about how we reunited faster and what led up to reunion, how it came together perfectly. Your real twin flame mission and how to start moving into it effortlessly so you can fulfill your true purpose how to know for sure if you actually have a twin flame, and how to spot a false twin flame. The exact steps to take to prepare to meet your twin flame to make the reunion happen more smoothly. A detailed explanation of what will happen when you reunite so that you can visualize it and prepare for this life-changing, beautiful experience. How the runner stage really works and what you can do to avoid, reduce or escape it this is stuff you've never heard before and could make a big difference to how happy you are during this process. How to effortlessly maintain the twin flame relationship once you've reunited. This is important as many twin flames meet and reunite only to break up or run away again. The unusual but highly effective exercise you can do to merge your goals and purpose into one and support each other in this growth. The best way to deal with conflicts or arguments in a twin flame relationship so that you both feel closer after each argument and they just bring you further into union and love. How and why you should repeat affirmations every morning. You'll also get a beautiful printable morning routine and affirmation sheet too. So like we said, it's really important to only take advice from twin flame gurus who are actually in union. So just to remind you, here is some of the things you get in the twin flame reunion fast track. So you'll get a high quality PDF ebook, a guided meditation audio track with rain noises and binaural beats to help you visualize your twin flame. You'll also get a beautifully designed printable morning routine to help raise your vibrations and magnetize your twin flame into your life. A printable affirmation sheet to set up your day every morning, 
a private video teaching you how to create the ultimate vibration raising super smoothie. A private video showing you the secret exercises to get your chakras to really spin up and awaken your kundalini. We would highly encourage you to order the reunion fast track today and start attracting your twin flame into your life. So to make it a complete no brainer for you, we've included several free bonuses. So number one, you'll get a raise your frequency ebook worth $97 showing you 15 powerful biohacks and techniques to raise your vibrations to attract your twin flame. The second bonus is our twin flame morning routine. This is a wonderfully designed morning routine that you can print out and follow every day. It shows you important habits to build and exercises to do every morning. It also comes with a printable routine sheet as well as two private videos. You'll also get a guided meditation audio track worth $47 which walks you through the process of visualizing your twin flame on a relaxing beach. It also has binaural beats tuned to theta in the background to really help you to visualize and attract your twin flame. The fourth bonus is a printable twin flame affirmation sheet, a printable affirmation sheet to stick on the mirror in your room. This affirmation sheet gives you some powerful statements to read out to yourself every morning to start raising your vibrations, feeling better and attract your twin flame. And then finally, you will get access to the Twin Flame exclusive Facebook group worth $99. This is lifetime access to the Facebook group where you can meet, talk to other Twin Flame couples, share experiences and ask us questions as well. So just the bonuses alone would normally cost over $300, but you'll get all of them completely free if you order the Reunion Fast Track today. You'll get instant access to all of the files, the downloads, the videos, the audios, and you'll be able to start speeding up your reunion right now. There's also a 60 day money back guarantee. So if you're not satisfied with this for some reason, or if you or if you feel like you're not getting the results you want, you can get all of your money back within two months. So if you would like to get on board with this program and get involved, we're not sure how long we're gonna be offering this program. The price will probably go up in the future uh, because there's a lot of value. We're constantly updating it and making it better. The link is below. So if you wanna get involved with that, go and check it out. Okay, so now phase three, I guess you could say, the hardware, the physical things, exercises, um, techniques, things you can actually do that will input to your body and help. But just to clarify, this is not instead of the emotional software stuff. Both are equally important. So you need to change your inner game, so mindset, beliefs, subconscious, emotions, and then also change the physical things you do. What's interesting is when you do these things, the physical hardware stuff, right, usually they will create an emotion which will then help you to change the, um, the hologram. So they kind of all link together. For example, when you do exercise, let's say, not only are you circulating chi energy, aligning the chakras, releasing endorphins, but that creates a positive emotion, which helps you to experience more of that positive emotion. It attracts those positive things to you. So there's really three pillars when it comes to your hardware, so your, uh, your physical body. Uh, things you can do to, um, end the separation stage faster and unite with your twin flame. And it is diet, supplements, and grounding. Those are the most important. We share more in our, or in our program, uh, but these are the ones we're gonna dive into now a little bit. So the first thing is diet. And diet is very controversial, right? Uh, some dietitian says you need to focus on meat, like paleo, going back to the stone age. Others say, no, you need to go completely plant-based. Uh, others say you should cut carbs. There's so many different diets out there. But the main thing is focusing on whole foods, so things that are gross, uh, high vibrational foods. Because if you want to raise your vibration, you need to eat foods that are high vibrational. It's, mm. it's pretty simple when, when you think about it. So the next one is to do grounding. You can do this regularly, um, maybe a few times a week. It doesn't have to be every single day. So basically grounding is, if you imagine our bodies are electrochemical, which they kind of are, right? Um, we have electrical charge that builds up within us. Mm. And this, this charge is built up through inflammation, bad foods, let's say, or even electromagnetic radiation and frequencies that we're all we're surrounded by, essentially, through our Wi-Fi, our phones, Bluetooth, whatever. So unless you discharge that, mm. uh, that kind of extra energy, extra, extra electricity, it builds up within you and it looks for particles to bind itself to. But this is not good because it kind of tears those particles apart. And um, the good news is it's very easy to discharge this electricity. All you need to do is go and stand barefoot in a, in a field, basically. Mm -hmm. Or um, even, even more effective would be to do an ocean dip. And then you're getting the benefits of all of the bacteria in the ocean, 
the uh, cold therapy, it boosts your immune system, you're getting fresh air, sunlight, and you're discharging all of that extra electricity from your body. And even if you live in a cold country, like we're talking, there's ice <laughs> and like snow, you can do it then as well. Like this yeah. has become very popular nowadays and we did it the other week mm -hmm. uh, and it's January now. So it's really, really good. So uh, we challenge you to do a cold dip this year. Yeah, even if you do one a month, um, yeah. that's much better than nothing. But so I would say everyone can go and walk barefoot in a patch of grass. Yeah, That's usually accessible to everyone. And you don't have to spend long there, just five or ten minutes, you know. Um, if it's summertime and it's nice weather, just bring your Kindle or bring a book, read your book on the grass. And that grounding will really make a difference to your inflammation, essentially. And I would say grounding is especially important for Twin Flames because you are a very high vibrational spiritual being. And it's very easy to be like up in the blue uh, and having this um, homesickness to the stars, right? Where, where you're from. Um, so many twin flames and light workers, they actually need grounding more than the average human being. Yes. And so moving on to the next thing now, supplements. Now, obviously, we're not medically qualified. Uh, according to Western medicine, we're not, you know, doctors or, or whatever. Uh, so please take these with a pinch of salt. This is just our suggestions mm -hmm. based on our experience. Um, there's a lot of supplements that we take, which we think are really beneficial to reducing inflammation, helping your body and everything like that. Um, so we have things like turmeric, which reduces inflammation, vitamin D, which helps with the immune system. And especially if you live in a cloudy country like we do, uh, it's important. Omega-3, which is good for reducing inflammation. Magnesium, zinc, especially if you're a guy, these, these are very important supplements. So you might be wondering, you know, why as a twin flame, why should you care about taking these supplements or improving your diet or something like that? So that's a good question. So basically, when we talk about the hardware, we're talking about our, our physical input to our body mind complex. So when we take certain supplements that reduces inflammation, that reduced inflammation helps our body to feel better. And I know it sounds really basic, but it's literally this simple. It helps our body to feel better, to perform better which will make it easier to experience the positive emotions, um, gratitude, to be vibrant, healthy, energetic, which will then make it easier for you to get more of those of those emotions. So it's essentially like, uh, what would it be like? Almost like the fuel. Mm. Yeah. So when you eat high vibrational food, you have less injuries, you have less um, disease. And the same thing with the grounding and, and taking the supplements. It reduces these uh, things that cause negative emotions disease, suffering, pain, um, bad health, whatever. And it replaces it with high vibe. So you're more vibrant, more energetic. And then that makes it easier to have these positive emotions, basically. Yeah. And not only does these things help your physical body, but also your energy body and your mm. spiritual body. So um, this will help you be more in tune with the guidance you're getting from the universe, help open up your pineal gland. Um, so this will make it easier uh, on your spiritual path to faster reunite with your twin flame. So it doesn't only help your body be more energized, vitalized, uh, but also um, on a spiritual level to help unite with your twin flame. All right, so now we're gonna dive into some questions that you guys have. The first one being, how do I know if Reunion Fast Track course will work for me? So this course is based not only on our personal experience, so we're a twin flame couple in a full happy union, but also years of detailed research. We truly believe this is everything you need to know to unite with your twin or attract them into your life as fast as possible. And if for some reason you're not 100% happy, we offer a full refund on everything. So what about if you see, if you feel like your situation is hopeless, maybe your twin flame is with somebody else, maybe they have married somebody else, they're in a different country, or it just seems like nothing can change the situation you're in. This is actually really common and you'll be amazed at how seemingly impossible things can happen very quickly and very effortlessly when you have done the right things. When you've raised your vibration to a certain level, when you understand the uh, how the emotions are the language to the matrix, things that seem like they would never change can collapse and reform into something different almost overnight. It's absolutely amazing and our lives have been examples of that you know, through the law of manifestation and vibration, we've been able to essentially create everything and anything we want to experience in this reality. 
for example, for me personally, I've been able to heal chronic acne. I've been able to heal an in, a knee injury that I was told would be impossible to recover from, essentially, uh, to owning a house, traveling the world, building a business where we do what we love, being able to leave the jobs we didn't like, and a whole lot of other things as well. The point is, these things at the time seemed like they would never change. I thought my knee injury would last forever. And the, it's the same thing with all of these other things. I thought at one point that no matter what I do, for me, it just can't change. The situation can't change. But I was so wrong. And when I changed my beliefs, and this is all about, it's all about the beliefs, really. When you change your beliefs and you start focusing on the emotions, the feelings, thoughts, and ideas that you want to experience, the whole, the, it's almost like the whole universe forms that around you and you create the reality you want, even if it seems like it's impossible. Next question. I've tried out the Twin Flame courses and they've not worked. So yes, there are many similar courses out there, but what makes this course so unique and powerful is that it was written by us. So a Twin Flame couple, not only in full union, but also with a short running stage. And this course will challenge the common belief that the running stage needs to last for years and years. Our running stage only lasted a few months and we've heard several other Twin Flames who are in the same situation. It doesn't have to be so hard. And if you follow the right system and advice, you'll have great results. And we have another question here. What are the, some other ways that I can shorten the running stage? So another really important thing you can do is focusing on self-love. That is so important. You can't expect your twin flame to love you and, and come to you if you don't love yourself because you are entangled on a quantum level and I would say this applies even if you wanted to just attract a soulmate, because if you don't love yourself, the world is going to reflect that back to you. Uh, it's basically you telling the universe, I don't want love. So focusing on self-love is going to be so crucial. Another way that you can shorten the separation stage is through a catechic healing. And this, this is something that is difficult to do yourself, but there are many uh, healers you can find uh, online, Akashic healers, who can give you this and we did this uh, in the running stage and this really helped shorten the running stage for us so do i need to get this program and speed up reunion some people ask should they even bother to try and speed up reunion what if it's meant to happen in divine timing for example well if you want to reunite with your twin flame then yes don't leave it to chance and risk chasing your twin for years you know you don't want to be watching your twin flame be with other people you can avoid all that and actually speed up reunion today so as Twin Flames, we have important missions. We're here to heal and help Mother Gaia ascend, and time seems to be running out. So our mission uh, as Twin Flames ourselves is to help Twin Flame couples like you come together in happy reunion and to change the negative narrative that's being taught. All right, next question. How do I know for certain if I have a Twin Flame? Well, nothing really happens by accident. You wouldn't have been guided to this a workshop if you didn't have a twin flame. So don't doubt your intuition and really thank the universe for, for guiding you here. Next question. I'm not sure if I want to unite with my twin flame. So we've all heard online that soulmate re relationships are less drama and more peaceful than a twin flame relationship. And yes, twin flame relationships can be very intense in the beginning as ego issues, traumas, etc. come up to the surface. But the truth is, these are things that needed to come up anyways as part of the ascension process. So you might as well do the purge now. And the twin flame relationship will become calmer and more peaceful with time. Just like many other twin flame couples who have been together for some time, we very rarely fight. And having a partner that is the only one in the entire universe who is on your exact frequency is just so incredible. Uniting as twin flames is literally the best thing that ever happened to us. So trust us, you definitely want to unite with your twin flame. If you run from the connection, the universe will keep giving you and not so much fun and life lessons until you reunite with your twin flame. So the best thing really is to just surrender to the twin flame journey. And this is what you signed up for in this lifetime. And the whole universe is watching and waiting for the twin flames to come together and help humanity in the transition to 5D Earth. So you might be thinking that maybe you don't have time to go through a, a big program or you know spend a lot of time watching these videos. The truth is you can go through this program at your own pace. You can take your time, you know, watch one video, video at a time. And uh, it's actually structured to give you really clear, easy to understand insights so that you can implement straight away. You can watch a video, 
take what you need to practice basically and pra and do it that same day. Um, but if you're worried about how long it will take, remember there's no deadline with this. What we would say is that when you put into action even just a few of these things that we're going to teach you, you will want to go through it faster because you'll see instant results. Specifically with sections on how to raise your vibrations, you'll see results pretty quickly and that will motivate you to go through it more, but you don't have to. You can just go through it in your own time, put the exercises into practice when you can, and you'll have lifetime access to the course, the members area, and all of the bonuses. The next question is, how do I access the course? Can I use my phone? The course is structured in a beautifully designed members area um, where you can print out the PDF notes, the PDF eBooks, and there's also lots of videos you can follow along with. It's created in a way that gives you the freedom to decide how to go through it. So you might decide you learn best by reading the PDF notes and listening to the audio version versions of the videos while working out, for example. Or you might prefer going through the course on your laptop while sipping your morning tea. It's entirely up to you, but you'll get instant access to the members area and all of that as soon as you've entered the payment information. There's no waiting around for us to manually create your membership. It's done automatically with some clever code so you can get started in the next few seconds. Take this time to invest in yourself and take the next step on the Twin Flame journey. You know, end the separation stage, attract and create Twin Flame union and step into your mission together. Uniting with our Twin Flame has literally been the best thing that happened to us. Like we're so freaking happy, <laughs> like hashtag blessed. <laughs> so uh, we really wish this for every Twin Flame to be together with the divine counterpart. There's literally nothing more happy, rewarding than this. Yeah. So yeah, hopefully we'll see you inside the program. Have a beautiful day.